between a group of officers and a mother trying to hold on to her baby. A shocking video shows the officers trying to yank that child from his mother's arms at a public assistance center in Brooklyn. The NYPD calls the video troubling and the outraged family is demanding justice. Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang is live tonight in Borum Hill. Lucy? Well, Sandra, we have dramatic video to show you regarding an incident inside the city agency behind me. HRA is supposed to assist those in need. Instead, police were called on a young mother. Her child was taken away because, we're told, she was sitting on the floor while waiting her turn. <laughs> It was pandemonium inside the Human Resources Building on Bergen Street in Brooklyn, which administers assistance to the poor. What you see here are police and HRA peace officers trying to take a one-year-old baby from his mother so they can arrest her. I was devastated to see something like that happen to my daughter and my grandson and how this officer was yanking on my grandson to get her out of my daughter's arms. Tonight, Jacqueline Jenkins is livid. She tells me her 23-year-old daughter, Jasmine Headley, is in jail and barred from seeing her own son, Damone. According to the grandmother, Jasmine had gone to the HRA building Friday morning to ask for daycare vouchers for her baby so she can work as a cleaner. We're told the city agency is slow and crowded. There were no chairs available, so Jasmine sat on the floor with her toddler to wait for her turn. Naisha Ferguson took this video and confirms mother and child were not blocking any doors or passageway. When HRA peace officers ordered her to stand, we're told Jasmine refused because there were no seats and she had her baby. A supervisor was called, then police. One officer even drew a stun gun and pointed it at the screaming crowd and the resisting mother. She called like five other security female security guards over and they all were just harassing her they was all just bothering her and everybody that was sitting in the chairs they was all telling them, like just leave the girl alone like she's not bothering nobody she's just sitting down like she's been here all day she's tired but they kept harassing her they kept i'm told jasmine will remain behind bars until her court hearing on thursday unable to work or get the voucher which triggered all this advocates argue her crime was not resisting arrest or trespassing or harming her own child but seeking help from an agency which then had her arrested. I was just so disgusted and I was like scared. Like I thought the cops were supposed to help you. They just straight up came and just attacked the lady. And that much force to rip her son from out of her arms. I don't understand that. Many have expressed outrage after seeing this video, but no response tonight from the mayor's office. Jasmine is now being charged with resisting arrest, obstruction, trespass, and harming her own child. We're live in Brooklyn, Lucy Yang, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Disturbing video indeed, Lucy. Thank you very much.